The human stomach is the ideal target for the eventual development of functional foods. It serves as the interface between nutrition and the transport of metabolic processes that sustain life. The necessary digestive procedures that could be modified to create satiety are the inhibition of food digestion, and this, in turn, controls how much fuel the body uses. The amount of macronutrients breakdown and absorption during colonic cellular metabolism, colonic microflora, fermentation, mucosal function. Bowel habits and the gut immune system constitute macronutrient breakdown, absorption rate, and extent. The core of several modern foods is intestinal probiotics, which promote the health of one's intestinal microflora. Prebiotics, conversely, stimulate the growth or activity of microorganisms, along which probiotics are instinctive. Select oligosaccharides that can selectively stimulate the growth of bifidobacteria in the colon have already been developed for consumption. Their claimed benefits are alleviating lactose melt digestion, increasing resistance to invasion by pathogenic bacteria in the gut, stimulating the immune system, and possibly protecting against cancer. To date, there have only been a small number of scientific studies on the effects of good prebiotic supplementation on people. Studies demonstrate that certain probiotic species positively impact the duration and severity of diarrhea caused by rotavirus among children. There are still many additional challenges involved in immunomodulation and exclusion, along with the role of digestibility in microflora, which must be tackled to some degree. Functional foods for gut health are still in their infancy. Matthew, cancer and stroke patient whose PhD was obtained at 65, asks you to help him raise awareness of health issues by sharing this valuable information. Please take the time to subscribe to and like this video.